Why is vocabulary so important for learners? Vocabulary in some ways is the most important dimension of language that learners need to master. There was a linguist called David Wilkins who famously said, without grammar, little can be conveyed. Without vocabulary, nothing can be conveyed. I think that's really true. Grammar helps us structure and refine and clarify what we mean, but vocabulary really does the heavy lifting in terms of conveying meaning. At the same time, vocabulary has traditionally been one of the most neglected areas of language instruction. As evidence, I can point to the curricula you find in most English programs and language schools. There are typically courses in reading and writing, listening and speaking, they cover grammar, and more and more frequently pronunciation as well. But courses that focus on vocabulary in any systematic way remain quite rare. For some reason, it's considered acceptable to just assume that students will acquire the vocabulary they need just through exposure to the language, for example, through reading or through their own efforts and intentional learning of vocabulary using notebooks or word cards or some strategy like that. But the problem with this assumption is that research shows learners really can't get all the vocabulary they need through incidental exposure. They also need to intentionally acquire new words as well. But the ways they go about doing this may not be effective. Often they have trouble selecting the most appropriate words for learning, identifying those that will be most useful to them, and identifying which aspects of new vocabulary they should focus on. Typically, they equate vocabulary learning with learning the meanings of words, but there's a lot of other information about words that they need in order to use them well. And even though it's impossible to teach all the vocabulary that students will need in their classroom because there's just too much of it, we can't neglect our duties as teachers with respect to vocabulary. We need a principled approach to dealing with vocabulary in the classroom. And an important aspect of a principled approach is giving students helpful strategies they can use for learning and using new second language vocabulary effectively. Professor Rinaldi pointed out that you can't say much without grammar, but without vocabulary, you can't say anything. Vocabulary holds the meaning. Vocabulary identifies the things that we talk about. So it's really important. He also pointed out that learners need instruction to learn vocabulary because they cannot learn all they need on their own. Students have trouble learning vocabulary on their own. It is difficult for them to select important words and understand what aspects of the words they need to study in order to be able to use new words. We will look at an example of how technology can help in the next video.